Tatooine. Tatooine is probably the first planet that comes to mind when most people think of Star Wars. Despite it being a desolate wasteland that represents the absolute worst place a person can be, a symbol of everything that every young Skywalker wants to escape from, it's apparently the planet that most fanboys want to visit. Cause we love Tatooine. And it is the planet that has shown up in more Star Wars movies than any other. So with so many iconic sequences to pull from, what are we going to do on Tatooine? Are we going to bullseye Womp Rats in Beggar's Canyon? Are we going to nearly crash into Jabba's sail barge? Are we going to fly between the twin suns themselves? Are we going to kill Tusken Raiders and not just the men, but the women and the children too? No, of course not. We're going to the more innocent Anakin sequence, the Ben-Hur ripoff. Wanted to do this. Okay, I know you're just saying that as a callback to the original Star Tours. I've always wanted to do this. But no, you haven't, you lying 3PO. Hang on, everyone! Man, we are flying low to the ground here. Like, I know we're lost, but surely the second we realized we were near Tatooine, which was not our goal, we could have flown around the planet instead of coming down to the atmosphere and just a few feet above the ground, right? We could at least fly over the race, right, 3PO? I'm just kidding, that would be boring. Narratively coherent and internally consistent, but boring. And Star Wars has always been about choosing excitement over logic. We've snagged a pod racer, which gives us twice the power. Does it? I mean, we can go light speed. I don't think the pod engines are going to make a difference. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. As we reach our cruising altitude, I just want to inform you all that in addition to our jet engines, we also soup this baby up with the engine of a 62 Ferrari. I do like this sequence, but I gotta say, it neither lives up to the potential of a space travel ride, nor the potential of a pod racing ride. I get why they wanted to include pod racing, it's a visually memorable sequence, but it's a real stretch to cram it into Star Tours. There are better ways to do a pod racing ride. I may or may not have more on that sometime in the future. 